Point Weather 12 forecast. Well, after reaching the 50s this afternoon, it'll start to feel more like December temperature wise tomorrow and especially this weekend. Even a little bit of snow this weekend. Not a snowstorm, some snow showers and flurries and things like that. So we're not breaking out the plows yet and the shovels. I will right, we'll get to that in just a second. Skies are clear in Providence and again, much cooler now than this time last night in the uh, mid to upper 30s. We'll head down to the upper 20s to low 30s during the overnight. Boroughville's at 36, uh, Providence 38, as well as New Bedford. Taunton checking in clear skies and 37. So staying dry tonight right on through Friday. Friday's a nice day. We're trending cooler to colder next several days, especially this weekend. Now both Saturday and Sunday, the chance for a few flurries and some sprinkles. But as far as these last minute errands and things you're doing for the holiday and shopping and holiday parties and things like that, we don't have any high impact weather both of these days. However, later Sunday night, watching with a little bit of interest, and even this, I'm not overly concerned, but by Sunday night, early Monday morning, some light snow and light rain mixed into early on Monday morning. And we'll watch this over the next couple of days. I'll show that to you in the seven day forecast, but even that I don't think requires any plows or shovels. All right, skies are clear. We are dry precipitation to our south. The jet stream will carry that out to sea. So we're looking pretty good when we take this into the future and watch as we advance into tomorrow morning and tomorrow afternoon. All of this real estate in here where it's clear and dry and sunny. That is Friday's weather. This is tomorrow afternoon. Take note. It's not in the 50s, but rather 42, 43. So it's, you know, it's cooler where we should be. See this gray offshore east of Cape Cod? Watch the low clouds back in off the ocean on Saturday. We'll have a persistent northeasterly breeze. This is Saturday morning and even into Saturday afternoon. And that sort of a what we call wind fetch brings in Atlantic moisture, low clouds, and sometimes sprinkles and flurries, especially across southeastern Massachusetts. But as far as any errands that you have to run both Saturday, Saturday night, even the daylight hours of Sunday, you're OK. This is more nuisance than anything else. Uh, as far as Saturday, again, the best chance for flurries and sprinkles would be across southeastern Massachusetts. The further west you go, uh, it's mainly dry, but cloudy and chilly. Tomorrow morning feels more like the season 32 at 7 a.m. Sunshine, 11 o'clock in the morning, 41. Looking good tomorrow afternoon, breezy, seasonably cool. Temperatures around 43 to 44. Clear cold for tomorrow night. Good news for uh, in Coventry, their holiday celebration. This is at um, Payne Field, which is on Main Street. This runs from 6 until 730, so a lot of fun. This includes a tree lighting as well. Temperature at 35 under clear skies, so it looks uh, pretty good. Bay forecast with unlimited visibility tomorrow. We got a north breeze at about 10 to 15 knots. All right, seven day forecast showing extra clouds, brisk and chilly conditions both Saturday and Sunday. Again, just flurries and sprinkles, nothing more than that. But we'll watch Sunday night with some interest, but even at this point, I'm not overly concerned. But the chance for light snow, light rain Sunday night ending early on Monday morning, chilly on Monday with a temperature near 40. Most outdoor stuff this weekend, uh, weather wise, we should be okay. It's just not as sunny as today. And too bad it's not going to be like the powdery pretty snow if it's mixed with the rain. As yeah, well. for Sunday night, I, I don't see that right now, but you know, those days are coming eventually. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want them that badly. All right, thanks, Tony. Right. Coming up